What's going on everyone? This is Kunal. In this video, I'm going to discuss Elastos, which is a project that has been out on the cryptocurrency market for a relatively short period of time, since early February. And it has seen a steady decline over the past uh, few months. So let's take a look and see if this is an interesting project and find out what's going on. So first you see the Elastos um, coin itself, uh, which is sitting at above $10 at 1088 and it has a market cap of about 80 million dollars a volume of four million dollars per 24 hours a circulating supply of seven million elastos and a total supply of 33 million elastos so given the circulating supply and total supply you can look at the price and the market cap and see it as something that you might want to invest in if you feel like this project has a future so the first thing i want to talk about is how i personally found elastos and that was late last year when they put out this video about the Elastos project on YouTube and what they were talking about in this video was th th essentially the members were setting up some sort of a side project where they wanted to create a decentralized operating system. They wanted to create a new generation of operating system that was different from the way that, you know, uh, Android works or even, you know, older like Mac and Windows operating systems work, which is that they're very closed source and they're centralized in many ways in terms of at least their distribution and in order to connect to the network there are many security vulnerabilities that are caused by building an operating system that allows individual users to connect to this network so what they're talking about is creating a whole new internet ecosystem and you can see right here on their twitter elasos is the world's first internet operating system focused on re-decentralizing internet with blockchain to secure identity and smart web powered by blockchain so if you go on their website, they call themselves a smart web powered by blockchain. And we can go down over here and take a quick look at what it's about. So Lassos is the safe and reliable internet of the future. Built utilizing the blockchain, this technology breakthrough provides the first completely safe environment on the web where decentralized applications are detached from the internet while also permitting full scalability to millions of users. Elastos enables the generation of wealth through ownership and exchange of your data and digital assets. Welcome to the new smart web where safety and economic distribution can flourish on the internet. So it talks about the Elastos runtime, which is a lightweight operating system run on mobile devices, the Elastos blockchain, which is then establishing trust on the internet by building a decentralized smart web where devices, individuals, websites, and digital assets have trustworthy IDs. Um, they talk about many different aspects of it, like in Elastos Carrier, which is the completely decentralized peer to peer platform that conveys information for applications by taking over all network traffic between virtual machines. So we've seen that blockchain itself and its core is on, it has so far been in terms of Bitcoin and some of the other big ones that have been adopted they have not been hacked in terms of their core integrity so many you know what they what an elastos carrier can do is really provide security for the exchange and conveyance of information and of course there's an sdk of you know used to access ids and elastos carrier service on the smart web so here's elastos's github page and what it does is it provide they really have some interesting stuff on here uh, that you guys can uh, go over on your own time um so they have some of their some of their you know what they want to do like for example guest runtime as an app engine they have some stuff written in c plus plus and go they have the elastos repo introduction here uh which if you open up it'll show you essentially articles and stuff uh, you know about you know the, the the developer guide the white papers and some basic and, and even an intro here including the short video that you guys can link here so their github is very informational and um, they do present information for you guys to follow so please do go on on their github which i will link below for you guys where you can get information for yourself on what elastos is uh, and so coin central describes elastos as uh, and, and it gives a short beginner's guide of Elastos, and um, it describes it as, you know, you have complete control of your digital assets. As a creator, this includes your books, movies, games, ETC, or even as an average user, your data. So what I like about this is the universality of this, right? Complete control of your digital assets. And in, in the 21st century, the digital assets are going to be really big. Having a blockchain that powers universality of all digital assets on the Internet, not just one type, gives it an advantage over you know niche kind of projects um so they go through this and, and they talk about the 
four pillars that enable network separation and platform flexibility. They talk about blockchain, carrier, software development, and runtime, which are the four pillars. And they talk about all the other things about Elasso. So you can, I'll link this article for you below. And the other thing about Elasso is, is it, it, there, it's being built right now as a joint on well, the, one of the top exchanges it's on right now is KuCoin. I think um, another exchange that it's on right now in, ter in terms of the highest volume is BCEX and Huobi, but um, uh, the two big ones are KuCoin and Huobi right now um, that it's on. So the, this that's really important for you for for to know. Hey, you know, if in order for it to be adopted, it needs to first uh, be accepted by some of the big exchanges. And if you take a look at this one right here, this article right here, uh, a lot, the reason that we could mention Elastos to you guys right now is that. Elastos is trading 31.4% lower over the last seven days. So mentioning it now, of course, this is not financial advice, but if you really do believe in this project and you believe that Elastos is, is going to be part of the future and it's going to be one of the top adopted coins, then you look at a number like this trading 31.4% lower than, than it has before. And you look at a, a, a trend where it's really uh, gone down over the last you know few months and you say to yourself, okay, do I believe that this project has a future and if i do this must be as good a price as you're going to get uh to pick it up and you of course we have to make a value judgment on the market as a whole right are we done falling down uh, are we done you know with bitcoin going under 7k are we done with that uh so we have to make the decision on our own as to when to get in but if you're looking if you believe in elastos uh then you believe that it then it's going to go up from here but of course this is not financial advice um and the 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 talk about uh genesis date being december 22nd 2017 and its total supply of 33.8 million right and so we talked about that and you can they also mentioned their reddit community if you guys are interested at r.elastos and a couple of other things i want to mention which is that elastos launches its ted testnet for public use so this just happened recently on july 26th so the blockchain platform designed for running decentralized applications has opened up for testing. So this is really interesting if you guys want to uh, look into that for more detail. Anytime a testnet is open, you, you're talking, you're not, you're not talking about theory anymore, right? Now you're talking about projects actually delivering. You're talking about projects actually putting into practice what they are preaching or what they are promising. So that's really definitely a step up for Elastos. Um, so you you they, um, we mentioned about their repositories on GitHub, which they have a link here. Um, the right, and if you are a developer, you can view our repositories. So that's something for you guys want to mention. And the testnet enables developers to begin doing various tasks, including mining ELA for development, creating a wallet app, and integrating ELA into another application. And they talk about, of course, the price has been in a steady downtrend over the last three months, dropping from over sixty-one dollars to, uh, you know, now it's at around ten or eleven dollars. And they talk about a new age internet ecosystem that is entire about it's powered, powered by blockchain technology. So this is one of those cases where there is a real use case and a real need for it. A, de a decentralized operating system is very fascinating to hear about because I'm pretty sure many of you guys are tired of, for, for, for one instance, getting updates sent to your computer all the time or updates sent to your um, phone all the time about patches or something else and and somehow an update ruins your phone or something like that. many there have been many stories like that so getting a decentralized operating system that that can change the way the operating systems work in, in for the future is definitely something that we want to see so thank you guys for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it um we're going to Go to altcoinbuzz.io, which is our website, and check it out for a second. Uh, so you can see some of the latest stuff we put out, like New York Stock Exchange owner launches a crypto trading platform. That's the latest thing we put out. And why not mine with a TV set? So is that possible? Um, and so we put out podcasts as well, and we have, of course, the latest updates. And we have a Twitter page where you guys can follow us, where we put out the latest uh, information about what we were talking about. We even have some, you know, analysis and some commentary on what's going on on the market. And we even put out polls or sometimes we ask questions about what is the best buying crypto right now. And we ask for your opinion on that. And then we may even mention those in some videos uh, later on. Of course, that's Allcoin Buzz. We also have Allcoin Buzz IO uh, or Allcoin Buzz Ladies, I should say, at A Buzz underscore Ladies, where they put out their channel and what updates they're doing and some of the latest videos that they've put out 
on the market. And finally, of course, um, last but not least, please do uh, like this video. And if you feel free to subscribe to our channel where we have over 209,000. And uh, we really talk about many things across the board. One of our previous videos and a couple of videos was about Bitcoin dominance, which is a really interesting thing. So if you want to do uh, check that out, please do so. So thank you very much, guys, and have a great day.